what is up guys we are back and i am right before like the day um before the month ends and we have this cut scene where dimitri tells us that they've located the enemy it seems they're hiding in the sealed forest right near the monastery lady Rhea has summoned all of the knights to return and take them down and all of this is being done in secret why to keep us no to keep you in the dark yeah, why the secrecy? Lady Rhea likely assumed you wouldn't be able to stop yourself from confronting the enemy if you knew their location. But that is not how the story ends, is it? Professor, we're at the ready. Order us to depart, and we'll fight at your side. No, I will not allow it. This discovery comes just when the knights are at their busiest. It is all too likely that our foes revealed themselves to lure you out there. They are the ones who took Gerald from you. I know how you must despise them, but I must ask you to rein in your personal feelings for now. Please, Professor, do not act carelessly. I ask that you leave this to us. Losing you so soon after losing Gerald would be unbearable. Lady Rhea, Seteth, please try to understand our reasoning before you refuse. With most of the knights still far away, we cannot afford for you two to leave the monastery undefended. The enemy's strength is yet unknown. The only warriors who likely stand a chance are those who wield relics. With all that in mind, it's obvious who should be dispatched, is it not? If the professor leaves, we will go as well. We've already made preparations, and are ready to depart at a moment's notice. Surely you must see that we cannot wait any longer for the knights to gather. Please, do what must be done, and give us the order. Professor, do you agree with this strategy? Understood. Hell yeah. I will give you the order. Destroy the enemy that is hiding in the sealed forest. You have the protection of the goddess on your side. Whatever happens, you shall overcome. No matter what enemy we face, we will not fail. I promise you that. You've done me a great service. You've done me a great oh, yeah, I was kind of late on completing some of these uh, these quests. <laughs> but alrighty, um, as far as I know, everybody is pretty much set. I don't think there's anybody that can. Oh, never mind. She can do advanced to become a bishop. Hundred percent. So that's two bishops I have now. Well, I'm. Which worked out because she just um, got like the skill as a uh, as the priest. And let me just be just like to make sure that everybody else is is set on their classes. Uh, yeah, as far as I'm concerned, everybody else is where they should be. The sealed forest is up ahead. Stay alert. This is for Captain Gerald. I will not falter. It is time to repay the kindness of the professor who saved my life. Leave it to us, professor. I'll give it my all. Fighting Tomas? It will be difficult, that's for certain. I don't really love the idea of fighting people I know. We don't have a choice. Even if it's difficult, an enemy is an enemy. We've just got to get it over with. Just kill them from behind. As long as you don't see their faces, you won't know if you know them. We won't know unless we see their face. 
Yes, I suppose that is true. Professor, I hope you know I meant what I told you before. Your enemy is my enemy. And I will follow you until the end. Whatever that end may be. Okay. That's reassuring, bro. <laughs> yes, right. We'll fulfill our duty together. We've come this far. We can't stop now. I hope you know that you can rely on us. No matter who the enemy is, we are prepared to cut them down. Yes. See, I'm enjoying the loyalty I get no from these guys. No matter who they may be. Alrighty, uh, I think our inventory is pretty good for now. Oops, I forgot to check who's even out here. Demonic beasts! That kind of sucks. I don't know why here. I did that. <laughs> oh, two of them. Hello, you're here. Welcome to the forest of death. <laughs> Looks like an assassin. My name is Kranya. This weakling girl was just a borrowed look for me. Kranya. Oh, snap. <laughs> this is what I really look like. Now, you vermin. I'll take down every last one of you. Oh. Uh, Stay focused. Good luck with that. So. I'm on it. What should I do? We'll just put everybody on focus. Hopefully they split up in two teams. If this takes too long, I might be forced to escape. Oh, or do you simply intend to let me go? How accommodating of you. As for me, I intend to kill you all. <laughs> uh, I hope so. Um, I'm here to kill you. Kinda sucks I have this guy out here. I didn't want him out here. <laughs> okay, you did not split up evenly. See, the whole thing Ready. now is... How do we this stuff taken out? I think I just knocked off the shield. Oh, okay, no, that killed him. Um, put you there. I'll go. Ah, magic staff, nice. Guess we'll pick up this item. Here goes. Thank you. Here we go. Hey. Yeah. Ready when you are. Yikes. Let's take them out. Oh, 
cut through. Mm, that crit was nice. Yeah, I put new uh, battalions on. That's why you guys see like this whole level up for the battalions on them. I'm only I got uh, some better, some better graded ones, I'll say. I don't know where they max out at the level wise. There's a chest over here. I think I think Felix can open up chests as well. That looks weird. Well, I don't know why I waited. I should have used an item with her. Um, okay, I guess, I guess I can't. I thought I could open up chests with this guy. Yeah, that was kind of awkward. That's all she wrote. I will get strong. Guess we'll get this item. Ah, oh, there's even more up here. I didn't even see like this upper part on the map. Is 
my guy out here running like he's Sasuke. So to retire. How? how can I really lose to the lonely creature like you? Well. Solon, don't just stand there and stare. I need your help. Yes, you most certainly. What's do. he about to do, kill her? Huh? Or he's about to turn into a monster. The heck? Have no fear, Kranya. Your sacrifice will help to rid this world of the filthy vermin that have long infested it. are about to get very interesting. The time is finally come to unleash the forbidden spell of Zaharas upon our enemies! Ooh. I don't even think I have that sword on my character right now. <laughs> I can't remember. Hmm. Be gone with you, Fellstar. Fellstar. What was that sorcery? What happened to our professor? Yeah, they where did I go? swallowed by the mystical darkness of the forbidden spell. An eternity wandering in a void of nothingness, never to return to this world. To think, we almost had the sword of the Creator. That's a lie! There's no way the Professor is really dead! That's I'm right. Not. Our Professor is no ordinary human. I do not believe our Professor has fallen. It is possible that death has yet to find your friend, but there are worse things than death. Drifting through the darkness with These no dude's chance gloves of escape, and, uh, staff are pretty overwhelmed fire, with hopelessness. <laughs> it must be torturous. We cannot abandon hope, Your Highness. Our professor lives. I know it. You're right. We will save the professor. But first, let's destroy this fiend. I'll slice you into a thousand pieces as you watch with horror. You will know true pain before I finally allow you to die. How trite. But if you wish for pain, I shall oblige. If you prefer it so, you shall also be added to the ranks of the dead. You fool! You know, this music um, reminds me of something I heard in the Digimon game. Or Cyber Sleuth. No, even a boulder has more sense. Apologizing won't make things right. This darkness is terrifying. As you and I are one, I too am trapped within this void. But please consider this. This realm of darkness we are in is separate from the world from which you came. I mean that it would take a god to leave this place. Luckily, you're a goddess. In time, our hearts and minds will cease to be. Are you prepared to die? I am not. I thought as much. I also do not wish to die. And yet... <sighs> there is no other choice. Do you recall your father's diary? Mm -hmm. He said you were a child who never cried nor laughed. I think I am the one to blame. I must have been asleep, but 
Even then, I feel I was a part of you. I do not know how Rhea managed it, but she allowed me to exist inside of you. The truth is, I have always been with you. It is within you that I found my power yet again. The power of a goddess. The power of the progenitor god. Progenitor god, okay. My name is Sothis. By now, you must be well aware of what that means. I am the one who watches over Fodlin and the creatures dwelling there. I am Sothis. She who died and then returned. Hmm? There is but one thing left to do to save us from this darkness of eternity. I must now use the power of a god. However, I lack a body of my own. And so, I must relinquish all the power that I have... ...to you. Hmm. The time has come for you and I to join as one. And when that comes to pass... ...then I shall disappear. Um... But we like having you around. When I say disappear... ...I do not mean that all I am will be no more. My soul will join with yours, and you and I will never be apart. But I will no longer have the chance to speak with you. I shall miss it. Oh, it's gotta be another so way. So long have I been on this path with you. Through you, I got to see and hear this world. I even got to chastise you from time to time. I may not have acted like a goddess, but it was certainly fun. For all that you have done, thank you. I'm glad that it was you to whom my fate was bound. Now, we must pray. For if we share this wish, our spirits too will join as one. Your wish is to return to the forest, stop the enemy, and rescue the little ones. <laughs> no need for words. I know your heart as though it were my own. Well, let's see how this goes. <laughs> your will and mine are now as one. Both sides of time are revealed to you, and you alone. You know I am the beginning. What shall you do? Snap, my boy going ultra instinct on us. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're literally slicing through life. So the Philstone consumes even the darkness itself. Yo, what, look at my hair. <laughs> I'm out here doing Dragon Ball Z transformations, guys. Professor, that is you, isn't it? Oh, I'm glad you are safe. I was sure that you would return. Please tell me all that happened to you later. For now, it's imperative that we kill the Yeah, you the talk demon. too much, Dimitri. We gotta, we gotta kick some what ass. What did you see in the darkness of Zaharas? This should be impossible. The only being that can withstand that darkness is... Unless I dispose of you myself. I may never have the chance to send you back there! Okay. Do I even have that, uh... I 
I can't remember if I have it on me or not. Let me look at my convoy. Yeah, no, I don't. Let's trade you. Uh, Sublime Creator Sword. Okay. Ooh, that sword looks nice. So I think my plan is to have a paladin go to each side and try to move him up best I can. This guy, I might just keep him back because... Oh man, he's just a burden to have with me. Accidentally brought him. Yes. kind of funny he's just like coming with but not doing a damn thing in these fights uh, let's break that pull out that next bar of health for me we'll just move you out the way so you can fight those guys and we'll just eradicate you That crit was nice. I'm getting Alert the stance. Oh yeah, totally forgot. It was like a second thing of health. Huh. Nope, he can't reach sadly. I was hoping he would. set some bushes on fire. Alright, cool. He's been taken out. Now we can uh, do a little heal there. By a little, I mean a lot, because her healing's fire as hell now.
This would have been like the perfect time to have Dor Dorothea with us so I could uh So I could have her give like somebody like extra movement. Oh man, I could have attacked, damn. I have no time to waste on the likes of you. Oh, I'm glad you feel that way, bro. Because, uh, oddly enough, you was about to go bye bye. By you. Even though an emotion like fear has no place inside me, that means you must be eliminated. Hmm. To think Once that white. I would <laughs> lose to mere beasts. We must oh, all and I hit level 30. But this is not the end. Tullus will carry out our mission somehow. Tullus? Does he also serve the Flame Emperor? It can't be. Professor, I'm glad you're okay. And you seem relatively unscathed. I'm... I'm so relieved. What's more, Gerald's foe is dead. Though we took little satisfaction from it. Professor, I must ask. What happened after we were separated? You look... different. The goddess appeared and gave you her power? It's as though the legend of old has been made flesh. It's hard to grasp, in all honesty. But having seen you pierce the sky with my own eyes, I find myself unable to doubt it. Yes, the legend of Saint Seros. It is said that she received a divine revelation from the goddess and was gifted with her power. Advanced stops <laughs> to defeat an evil king who went mad with power. Perhaps the goddess saw the goodness of Seros within you too and wished to help you in your quest to defeat evil. <laughs> if you're Seros granted power by the goddess, then I suppose that makes me. Ah, never mind. I'm getting carried away. Professor, what's wrong? Are you. Uh, are you asleep? What is happening these days? Well, it matters not. We must get you help, and fast. It'll be faster if I carry you and run. In time's flow See the glow Of flames Professor, 
You must remain still. Everything is all right. There is no need to worry. Those who are trying to harm you are far away. How lovely it would be for this moment to last forever. I wish I could hold on to this time we have stolen. That you and I could create a world without end. Hmm? I have heard whispers of what happened to you. Your appearance. You have received power from the goddess. From the moment you took hold of the sword of the creator, I prayed that one day the radiant power of Sothis, which bathes Fodlin in its celestial light, might reside within you. But you are so much more than the light. You are my... <sighs> Close your eyes, dear one. Sleep. What Just am I, though? Just a while longer. I'm your what? I will be watching over you. Always. Always and forever. Part 1. White Clouds. Pegasus Moon. Throne of Knowledge. The northern lands are enveloped in a bitter cold, and frigid winds are carried across the sea to the south of Adrestia. When feather white snow falls on Fodlin's locket, the fort looks as delicate as a pearl. However, beneath that snowy blanket, her throat is more treacherous than ever. Story's getting good, guys. Rhea, please talk to me. What are you hiding? What is the meaning of how that one looks? It is almost as though... As I said, there is nothing of which to speak, for now. At the end of this month... I read Gerald's diary. I happened upon it in his room. What? In it, he stated the reason for his departure. The baby, thought to have died in the fire, has returned to us. Gerald realized that you had done something to the child and decided to flee. What did you do to that baby, Rhea? Nothing questionable, I should hope. Setteth, enough. They will be here shortly. No more, I beg of you. I will take our dear professor to the holy tomb. There, I should be able to see our dearest wishes to fruition. When I was young, I heard her voice there. I'm sure of it. You may enter. I have been awaiting your arrival, Professor. Now that you have received sacred power from the Goddess, there is somewhere you must pay a visit to at once. You must go to the Holy Tomb so that you may receive a divine revelation from the Goddess. Hmm, a revelation? The Holy Tomb is where the Goddess sleeps. This monastery was originally built for the purpose of protecting that hallowed temple. Only a select few know of it, but there is a legend about Seros and the Holy Tomb. Saint Seros, the first soul to be gifted power from the Goddess, received her revelation there. She was told that it was her sacred duty to save the people of Fodlin, 
and that she must use her power wisely in order to lead them. The words that were handed down to Saros from the goddess will likely fall upon your ears as well. Prepare yourself to go at once. There may you find out why you were blessed with such power. There will be a Sounds ceremony good. at the Holy Tomb. It is then that you will receive the goddess's revelation. You may share this mission with your students. It is said that when Saros received the revelation, she had holy warriors by her side protecting her. Your students, who have followed you and fought alongside you through oh, the darkest be my holy times, warriors, huh? are well suited to stand by you for the ceremony. Of course, as the leader of the Church of Saros, I will be by your side as well. The occasion is too significant to be missed. Even if something were to happen, I am more than capable of protecting myself. Much has changed, but your duty has not wavered. Steal your mind for the ceremony and prepare your students well. Alrighty, well, that looks like that's what uh, my mission is, guys. Uh, prepare these students for uh, the trip to the Holy wow, Tomb thanks. so we can get that uh, revelation. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I know I was enjoying this episode. It turned up pretty quick. We have like a new transformation on our guys if we're in the Dragon Ball universe. But guys, make sure you leave a like for the video if you haven't. Subscribe to the channel as well if you haven't. It helps out the channel a lot. With that said, take it easy. Later.